The time was 1972, at the height of the Vietnam War. Zoya Horn, librarian and anti-war activist, was the only one who refused to testify before the grand jury on the sensational Harrisburg 7 trial. Both as a citizen and as a librarian, it was against my conscience to, to um, cooperate uh, with this black charade and the black charade got the, the um, judge and he sent me off to jail. The trial was soon dismissed and Zoya found herself in California. In 1983, she joined the data center and founded the Right to Know Project. Today, Zoya continues to speak out for intellectual freedom and inspires through her passion and spirit. Throughout her life, Zoya has broadened the definition of censorship to include all pervasive barriers that restrict access to knowledge, like sexism and racism that distort judgment and realities. And this is the very core of the work of the Data Center, ensuring our community's right to know and our collective responsibilities to produce that knowledge ourselves. <laughs>